27th of April 2018. Okay, today is Saturday. This is a female red ear slider, 21 years old. Now, how to tell whether this is a male or female? There are, there are few, few things you can see here. And the one is, of course, the claws. In the male, the claws are very long. All the claws are long. But this one is not very long. And uh, other than that, you can see the lower part. Now, if this is a male, this part will be more concave. More concave. The lower shell, but this one is almost flat. Almost flat. So that is usually female. And uh, these are the two two areas we see. Now this uh, 21 year old is definitely poorly uh, poorly uh, nourished. He didn't he didn't eat well, is it? Because normally they are much bigger. They're much bigger and uh, you can see the shell is sunken. So what do you feed last time? You had this for 21? Just, um, mm. All sorts of things, like chicken, prawn, I just throw it into the basin. Mm. You have it for 21 years, right? Mm. From the young, right? Yes. From hatchling. Uh. Okay, so you was eating a variety of uh, food. Uh. Including pellets as well. Pellets. So, so over the years, you can see that uh, at certain times she had a very uh, good diet. I get, so you can see the ridging, the thing ridges. So after that, I think the diet was not so good. When 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 when, when was the the top shell sunken? I cannot remember. Mm, the one is sunken. Okay, so today the complaint is not uh, active for one month. Uh, how many months? One month. Active for two months. Two months. And eat very little, right? Eat very Only pellets. Only pellets. Mm. And that time was ice solemn. Was there any swelling here? Uh, no. No swelling here. So, now today, as you can see, these are the swelling. The fluid, there's fluid underneath the skin. Uh, so, the whole skin is uh, uh, swollen. Uh. So, in theory, you could, you could suck out the fluid and uh, but it's only temporarily cure. Now you can see the pores are swollen, so but not so bad in front, but they're swollen. Then the back one, definitely the legs are swollen, the paw. This is bad. Huh? This part is not so swollen, but it's still swollen. Huh? This is only one week ago, is it this swelling? I didn't notice. Hmm. Okay, then we can see the side. Only the owner there is a red redness here, inflammation huh? on the bridge. This is called the bridge, connecting the upper and lower shell. These are signs of uh, inflammation. This side so. is Is she the only one living alone? Yes. It's like infection and bleeding. Huh? So this is pretty bad. Before they don't have like this redness? No. no. It's just only one week ago? Yeah, I think so. Mm, okay. So he has been to the other vet about two days ago and this prescribed anti uh, antibiotics, multivitamins, calcium, and also injection to bring down the the fluid. Uh. So two, two two injections, right? So the owner gave two injections here. You give here the back side. Yes, both. Uh, both and also the calcium, right? But uh, but uh, it seem seem to be no effect. Any effect? Is the appetite better now? It's not eating anything. Still not eating, huh? Mm. Okay, so for the examination, I will say that uh, there is something wrong with the either the heart or the lungs. Not heart, liver or kidney, because these are the three things. Did, did, did the radius slider like pass motion? Never. No, no. For how long? Very long. About so, one month. Oh, I didn't eat so. So now the treatment, uh, but this is 21 years old, normally I would ex estimate that they live up to 30 uh, if they're healthy. Uh, and normally the size is about another 30% longer in behaviour. <coughs> so now the, the treatment is uh, either you let us give treatment by mouth and uh, monitor you for two weeks or one week. And uh, then I will draw some fluid out 
by strings. And according to owner, there's some sounds, right? Is there some sound? No sound. It's huh? yawning for. No sound, you Yawning away. Okay, you, you hold first. No, you hold. Uh, I open the mouth. According to him, the other vet has found the uh, somewhat some ulcers. No? No, I will just open the mouth. I will use his light now first. No, the eyes is really swollen. Oh, okay, open. Okay. Let's shine the light on. See, after I will show you from the video the tongue. Yeah, this ulcer there and the tongue. You can see, I have a quick look there. You see, the tongue should be normally don't have these white things okay. there. Mm. Oh, mm -hmm. ulcers are on the tongue, so it's mm. painful, mm -hmm. and that's why it doesn't eat. Now, has it been in the water for 24 hours a day? Yes, no, so it shouldn't be, you know, shouldn't be. Oh. so the bacteria might have gone in. Okay. It's been dead for, for many many years. Yes, I always put in shallow water. No, yeah, but don't have dry dry. No, no uh, don't have dry time. Like, uh, those days are mistake. Uh. No sun also. Once in a while. Then when you change water, every. Once it's dirty, uh, so, I, put, I put food inside. So you don't change every day. Uh. No, every day I change. But it's only the when the food is dirty uh, or the water is dirty, then I change. No, I mean water you change every day or you don't change every day. Or you change every few days. Every day I change. Every day, not, not when the water is dirty. La. No, no. No, it's very thin. La. What is it that's the shipping of this? These are the shell. No, they, they change. Huh? They have new new one coming out. Huh? Oh, is it? Huh? Like molting. Huh? Mm -hmm. so this one is okay. So we will treat first. And uh, this, this this is a case of most likely a septicemia infection. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, most likely. The shell rot as it recover. You said last time he had skin disease, right? The shell right? Last time I treated for shell. No, last time I didn't treat it. I just okay. leave it alone, but it get okay by its own. I thought you said you saw another vet for this shell one? No. No, only two days ago. No, oh, okay. okay. So you never been sick before? No. And does it walk around the apartment? No. No. So the In a tank all the time. Yeah. And no sunlight. Huh? No. What do you feed? Pellets? Pellets, chicken, raw chicken, raw prawns. Yeah, but all this contains some like bacteria no, because of fermentation. Uh, okay, can so be a treaty now for them.